Hey guys, so to start out I'm going to prime my skin using MAC Strobe Cream in Pink Light and then for foundation I'm using the Makeup Forever Ultra HD Foundation. Mine's in the shade Y245 and I'm just blending it all out with a damp sponge. Then to cream contour, I'm just taking the Benefit Hoola Quickie Contour Stick and I'm just popping that on, on my cheekbones, underneath my bottom lip, my jawbone and around my hairline. And I'm using the Models Prefer Airbrush Foundation Brush to buff all of this out. Then I'm going in with my Holy Grail Concealer, the Tarte Shape Tape, and I'm applying this under my eyes and down the center of my face to give a highlight. And this one's in the shade Light Sand, and I'm just going in with my damp sponge once again and blending all of that in. And I'm making sure I pop this onto my eyelids as well, just so they're primed for when I go in with the eyeshadows. To set all of that concealer, I'm taking the MAC Mineralized Skin Finish Natural in Light Plus and I'm just using a F35 brush from Sigma and I'm patting this all into those areas where I popped my concealer on. Then to bronze my skin up, I'm using Benefit Hoola Powder Bronzer and I'm just taking a Sigma F05 and I'm pretty much popping that everywhere I put that cream contour. Then I'm just taking my damp sponge once again and I'm just blending all of my edges out. Then for blush, I'm taking this one from Sigma. I cannot pronounce the name of it for the life of me. So I will have the name listed down below as always. And then for highlight, I'm taking the Anastasia and Nicole Guerrero palette and I'm mixing the two middle shades. Again, I'll have the names down below and I'm applying this to my cheekbones, my cupid's bow, my chin, tip of my nose, the bridge of my nose, and just above my brows. Then to set everything and melt all my powders together, I'm using MAC Fix Plus in Pink Light. Moving on to the eyes, I'm popping some tape onto the outer corners just to give me a nice crisp line. And then I'm dipping into the Sigma Warm Neutrals Volume 2 palette and I'm taking the shade Toasty to start off with and I'm just buffing this all through the crease with an E40. Then going into the shade Henna on a tiny little blender brush. This is an E36. It's like the perfect cut crease brush. So I'm pretty much kind of doing a cut crease. I'm just really focusing that right along that crease line. Then I blended the edges with my E40 and then I dipped back into the shade Toasty and I just applied a little bit more above where I just put the shade Henna just to kind of mesh the colors together and make sure everything looked really blended. Then I'm going in to the shade Humble which is basically like a white shade and I'm just using an E60 to pack this all over the lid underneath where we put the browns and I'm just using this on my brow bone as well. Then for my liner, I'm using the Sigma Longwear Eyeliner Pen, I think it's called. And I'm just creating a wing with this. Then I just peeled away the tape and I had a nice winged line. Then for the yellow, which Kylie absolutely slayed, I'm using the BH Cosmetics Take Me To Brazil palette and I mixed those two yellow shades together and I'm really just packing those in the inner corner. Then I just tight lined using my Sigma Longwear Liner Pencil and going in with mascara I'm using the Rimmel Scandalize Wow Wings Mascara which you guys know is my new favourite. And then I'm just mixing Toasty and Henna together on an E36 and I'm just really lightly buffing this under the lower lash line. And for lashes I took the Coco Lashes from Glam by Manicare and popped those on. Then I sprayed my brush with a little bit of Fix Plus and picked up some black from the Take Me To Brazil palette and I'm just patting this over the top of my liner because I wanted it to be super matte and a little bit soft. Then I just coated my bottom lashes with a coat of mascara. 
And then finally for the lips, I'm using MAC Lip Liner in Boldly Bare. And then I'm filling them in with two different lipsticks. I started out with Velvet Teddy from MAC, but this was a bit warmer than what Kylie had. So I mixed in the shade Really Me, which is much more cool toned. And that is the completed look. It is so easy to do, and I really hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you in my next one.